Um. We can honestly just buy everything here. I don't think that was a bad shop. I don't think I'd be able to utilize everything. Oh, right, never mind. I can. This is better on this, right? Could go for a shovel. Kind of don't want to go for a shovel. I'm going to go for a shovel. <laughs> Just because that's on sale, we'll go for a shovel. We win this. Your DPS is buns. We win this a trillion times over. Probably should go for the card as well. Since we can't use the obsidian dragon, we're going to have to go with the flame dragon. So getting cards now versus later is better. And we're not getting a chili goobert, sadly. So no goober for us. Now, how do we set this up where it's not looking dumb? Probably that. Um, well, we might lose. That's a burst build if I've ever seen one. Early game burst build. Oof. Yeah, that critical, bro. Does not. Oh my god. Okay, let's go back to the drawing board of Berserkerism. Really, the only thing we can benefit from Berserkerism is like Dragon Scale armor, but that's. I feel like that's gonna take up too many slots. Honestly, Dragon Claws might not be bad, though. Nah, we need Vampiric Gloves. I take that back. Um, the 40% faster would be nice, but the, the Vampirism combined with Locturnal Locklifter is a little nicer. I guess Spike Collar, then. Just to increase our battle rage moments. That's the only thing I'd buy. Dragon Scale armor would be nice, but it takes up too many slots. I'd rather have Vampire Gloves over Dragon Claws. And in Dragon Scale boots, they're okay. I guess the empowerment would be nice for daggers, but eh. 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 I'm gonna take it. 15% faster, we take 50% reduction damage. Isn't horrible. I'll take this for space, this as well. And yeah. And yeah, give me some, some healing as well. That'll do it. That'll do it. Versus just a single torch with double shield. All right. We'll see how this goes. Battle Rage is going to be a W, question mark. Hopefully. Please. It's not being a W. It actually was a W a little bit. We still lose, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. It was a little bit of a W. But now that we have that, it's going to be way better. Uh, I forgot about the axe, bro. I mean, we could you literally use the axe to just carry us in the mid game. I'm going axe. I might go axe all the way now that I think about it. It's a very real chance I go axe all the way right now. Very real chance. An extremely real chance. Mm. We should win this. 
double broom versus my axage besides the fucking blind that he's putting on us but we have poison so we're fine and we got berserker mode so we're even finer yeah good game he barely won that surprisingly but good game do i need a mana orb <sighs> no i don't think so yeah i need this I know I passed up a helmet and a corrupted crystal on sale. I know, I know, I know. Don't don't be mean. Leave me alone. <laughs> I think I know what I'm doing. Otherwise, I just made the worst decision of my life. I don't know yet. We'll have to see. Gotta wait and see. I would love another axe though for a double axage. Probably should get gym boxes as well because it's an axe. <laughs> That's a thing. I think I win this though. They got stamina issues. And we're in berserker mode. Pong. One more hit. Pong. Good game. Hey, Lou. And hello. 11. Goodbye, both of you. You will be going here. Probably do that and do this. It's almost maxed out. Bloodthorn. I know. I see you, but no, we're going double axe on a freaking Reaper. Never done before, but I think it's going to turn out very beautiful. I think. Hopefully. You have no daggers. I think you're missing some. <laughs> I think we win this. Pretty sure we win this. I could do that too. Eventually, just wait on it. It's taking a little bit, but we'll get there. You know, we'll get there. Ah, see? Told you. <laughs> Good game. Boing. I don't need mana orb, right? I keep looking at it because usually I need mana orb. I think I'm okay without it. Um, yeah, take you. All right, let's see here. How are we gonna set this up? Definitely want to do that. And you're gonna go like there. That'll work for me. Got some. I want to turn these into flaming coals whenever I find the um, the dude. Guys, you guys know who I'm talking about. The dude. You know who I'm talking about. The dude. Gotta find a dude. I'm glad I met you now instead of later. <laughs> that would have been horrible. Although, you're not gonna have mana generation once you do that, my friend. So, you're not gonna be able to utilize that magic staff or that magic torch. So, like. You know, that's a thing. You might still beat me, though. I keep missing like that. Uh, yeah, I lose. I lied. Good game. Give me you. You and you. Oh, I'll, I'll buy it. I don't want anything there. Done healing would be nice, but I kind of want other stuff. see we're gonna have stamina issues aren't we i forgot about the joker card hmm that could theoretically fix my stamina issues not even theoretically it quite literally would work 
<laughs> right? I believe so. Ooh. At least they don't have mana for you. <laughs> that, that'd be worse, but it might be okay. Burning Sword increasing the damage of the Hungry Blade plus the Molten Dagger and the Molten Dagger increasing its own DPS uh, plus the heat generation from the Chili Goober. And then they have Flute. We got a lot of healing though, which is great for us. Very great for us. We don't have a lot of stamina, which is not very great for us. But other than that, our healing is pretty nice. Hell yeah, good game. Hello. I'll be yoinking you. Ooh, I'll be yoinking you. I'll be yoinking you. And I'll be yoinking you. Can I buy any of you this round? Well, eh, I should probably just go Bloody Dagger. Bloody Dagger is the smarter thing to do here. I need stamina. What am I going to do for stamina? I should probably get a flute, right? More than likely. Built diff? What does that mean? What does built diff mean? Does that mean I'm built different? I'm debating on selling a jewel to get this gloves, but I don't think I need to. We got four health. I can make I can make risky stuff. I can do risky stuff. We're fine. Okay, okay. I see that I see the build. Okay. I think we win this. He doesn't have his magic staff or magic torch like he needs it for both his arrows. It's a whetstone. Oh yeah, the yellow gems for stamina, you're right. I keep forgetting that. I don't know why, but that just slips my brain every time I think about it. Well, I never think about it, that's the problem. Good game. Pop. Fancing, fencing, rapier. Oh, how I love you. I could go ice dragon. Hold up. Nah. Too many combinations I need. Okay. Let's get this so I can just hatch it ASAP. You need to go like that instead. Um, Space. Always a good thing. Put this on the outside for that stamina. That can go like that. Oh, I can start turning these into burning coals now, which will help with heat generation, which will just be W. And that's looking juicy. It's a shame I don't have armor slots, but this is probably just going to force me to have an armor slot now. Because I can't pass that up. All right. We're looking good. Versus an eggy. That's a mediocre Excalibur. It's mediocre. It's all right. You know, it's not all that. You know what I mean? He's only got one cheese. Right? Only one mana orb. And his orb is, has the worst fucking location known to mankind. It's it's horrific. It is horrible. It could be way better. I think we win. Me and my ten vampires of glorious magnificency. Oh, I should probably move this to touch the vampire gloves. I don't know where to move it, though. We'll figure it out. I got to figure that out, though. Because uh, having eight heal per hit is way better than four. As soon as your berserker mode is over, it's game over for you, my friend. Hopefully. Hold up. Come on, berserker mode. Heal every single hit. Heal. A heal for 30 each hit. Heal. Keep it coming. Heal. Hold up. Hold up. God damn it. I did not want to lose that. Whatever. <laughs> kind of, I'm kind of sad. Hmm. Um, <clears throat> we could more than likely buy this because it's also an armor slot, which is smart. I'm gonna sell this for space though, and we can also utilize the mana orb to actually get this thing to proc. We don't really need poison or any of this food anymore, except for the banana for stamina. With that being said, do we buy the cap? Since we're using this for an armor slot now, we don't really need to. OK, 
could do this. No. Because then that diamond slot right there. Definitely a way to do this somehow. If I can't do this, I'm gonna be sad. I'm about to be sad. I don't think there's a way to do it. up this but like it's not on anything it's useless Anyways, that does not work because now it's not inside the diamond slot. Crap. Now we're back where we started. <laughs> Now we're back where we started. This might be the best I could do, though. Honestly. Yeah. Wait, did that just solve my issues? Oh, shit. That just solved my issues. Hell yeah. Everything is like... It works. Nice. <laughs> Unexpected. But nice. Okay. Um. Well, we might as well buy this to put there. And next round we can get the orb. Yeah. Um. We have nothing inside the poison at all. <laughs> I kind of want to try to utilize this banana. But I feel like putting it over here is best because of the double fanny. It'll just be. What is that, like 30% faster? Alright, that works for me. This works for me. Alright, that's looking like a burst build of death. He's got the crit, he's got the heat generation, he's got the dragons. Burst build of death in the making. At least he's not bursting at the start of the game. But he's about to burst. In two seconds. One second. Burst incoming. So did my berserker mode, which actually is... I would have said it was nice, but we're still going to lose, I think. Maybe not. Our healing is insane. Kill this man. Oh my God. I hit him with my dagger and it did zero damage because of the shield. I'm flabbergasted. It's okay though. We got Ruby up now. We got Ruby up. We got an orb proc. Everything is good within the world. Now, where do we put it? Here? That's a really good spot, actually. Now, where do I put my gloves of haste, though? Where do I want that? What do I want to make faster? The axe. Hmm. Tanner! What does that mean? Man. 
Banner. Banner? Oh, and a banana? I guess I could do this, though. I was thinking about the ruby well. Or the glowing crown. I could put it on the banana. A little situation like this. Eh, we'll, we'll keep it on the banana. No! Why did I... Oh my god. I need to reorganize. My Ruby Wub needs to be touching the lifter of Loch Ness. Do we win this though, still? I think so. We cleansed all his blind, which is good. We're going to be able to proc the glowing crown, which is good. And now we just increase DPS with the double axe. While also healing at the same time. Alright, I think we still win. And we got berserker mode as well. Yep. Nice. Got another one. I can afford you, right? Please tell me I can afford you. Uh, I'll just sell food. All right, we gotta move this. Uh, where? I feel like it has to go here. It's kind of unfortunate though, but yeah. still proc it's not horrible you know cope yeah that's that's not horrible it'll still proc <laughs> at least you're not gonna have stamina <laughs> You're removing my buffs, like a lot of them. You even got Tim. Why are you so evil? Maybe we'll be fine, because we still heal regardless. He hasn't he doesn't have decreasing he's not decreasing our healing, so we're still gonna be healing regardless. Like we've done a hundred damage to him, he's done zero. So I think we're good. Even if he's taking our vampirism. T, yeah, you're, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. I love how you proc your crown as soon as your berserker mode ends. Please heal. Okay, our crown proc. Our crown proc. And we went to berserker mode at the exact same time. That's game. What happens if someone had a mirror build? Would it come down to RNG? Pretty much. It'd probably just come down to like crit and stuff. Crit RNG, stuff like that. <gasps> oh, that was beautiful. Oh, that was a beautiful shot. Yes. We can get an upgrade here. We can extend our berserker mode. Such a nice shot. Have you ever seen a mirror build? No. Not unless it was at the beginning of the game. Then you'll see them because, you know, limited items and, and stuff. But other than that, no. I think I'm gonna move this here. 
just have it on mana or procs. Uh... We need space. Nice. I think that'll do it. If both players die at the same time, it just gives you to win. I think it's whoever took the most damage still, no? Like if both players are about to die at the same time, whoever was about to take the most amount of damage, I think wins or something like that. It's something like that. Do we win? Versus Mr. Poison Bomb? OG Poison Bomb build? I think we do win. This guy's been playing since... He did, well, I guess the last time he played was fucking... Six months ago where you could rock that item and... A bunch of stone skin potions and just... And just kill. <laughs> Good game, though. Both players can die at the same time. That's why I've never seen uh, one HP to zero HP. Oh, you've all yeah, you see that because like that's them dying at the same time. But the person who wins, that's what I mean. Yeah, yeah. Joker card. And I mean, we only got four rounds left. I don't think it's worth getting the Joker card with only four rounds. I should probably move this over by one. Actually do that. Woo! Y'all see how beautiful that looks? It's looking pretty gorgeous if you ask me. I can even move this and do that. Make all that faster, all that's being affected, brother. I like it, Picasso. I should probably just put... I should probably only just, just put the fannies on the rubies. Do I need you? No. something like that or honestly I could do this that way it's still inside two fanny packs but the the glowing crown is as well um, I, I'm debating on buying this fanny pack I feel like I should switch these two no that wasn't smart I was gonna do this but no, that's not gonna work I could just keep it like this though nah um I don't know if I have the stamina even utilize that but might as well do it why not Perfect spot, but no. It's not a bad spot either. Bum, bum. That'll do it for me. That'll do it. Do I need this? Hmm. It might make the glowing crown proc too early. We don't really need the clovers and we definitely don't need the spikes. So I don't think I need that in general. <laughs> Poison build, huh? Okay. With the dark saber, okay. Looking pretty solid. So is our build though. Our build's freaking awesome. Now that we got ruby chunk. If I can get me a second ruby chunk, that'd be great. And then ruby chunk get up to that uh, heat threshold, 12 heat, 30% chance of stun. Boom, bloody dagger. Jeez. Louise. Look out of her work. Let 
Look at her work. Back up the max health because invulnerability. And now we're just waiting on our uh, berserker mode to proc. Boom. Everything is faster now. And then we take less damage and we need to... What the fuck? <gasps> How did we lose? How did... What the fuck? What just happened? This proc at the very last minute where you about to die, you gain 90 health. I am disgusted. Absolutely disgusted. How dare that happen? How dare that happen? I look you want to buy this now, just for stamina. How dare that happen, bro? Still stuck on that. I'm gonna get it just for stamina, because I'm tired of that thing just meh, 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 all the time. Okay. An interesting build. Whoa, you really want your clover generation, huh? A hundred percent chance. Wow. Three piggies, hundred percent chance. And proking now. Yep. Well, unless you proc at the beginning of the game. I just didn't see it. Did I already proc in my oh please don't die? Okay, invulnerability! Yay! Bring it back, bring it back, bring that fucking health back. That's so fucking lame. To just get hit for 200 damage off of a critical. I'm upset. I'm upset. All right, we're not losing anymore though. That was the last L. It's the absolute last L we're taking. I guarantee it. What are chances of me flying a, a amulet, a blood amulet? <laughs> Turn this into a bloody dagger. Zero? Pretty much zero. <laughs> I don't even know why I got you, bro. I can't really do anything with you. You might do more harm than good. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm probably not going to use you. Okay, dragon build. Insta hitting me for a shitty shit ton of damage, obviously. Probably gonna proc my berserker mode early. Yep. Might be okay though. Potentially. And vulnerability. Get my health back. Add a stamage, which is okay. Because we could just stun him and just kill him. Cause that's what we do. Yes. Might as well keep going. Um, yeah, let's buy this. Everyone wants to live in the past, now want to live in the patch. No one wants to live in the patch. <laughs> what are you on? What are you talking about? Some patch. Hmm. 
No one wants to live in a patch. The patch is horrible. All my homies hate the patch. Trying to make this make sense. I guess it doesn't. I'm not gonna use this anyways. So I guess it doesn't need to make sense. Although the extra stamina would be nice. And I wanna fix it. Can't I like do this? Beautiful. 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 All right, that'll work for me. This is the build. It's very janky, but it works because Lock Turner Lock Clifter is awesome. It's only a 14% increase. I would love to have like another one or something, but the Blood Amulet didn't want to show his face. And then rocking the Ruby Chunks. For the, it's, it's honestly, it's low key just a dagger build like Double Ruby Chunks, Bloody Dagger, could have been more Bloody Daggers, but whatever. But it's basically a... It's basically a dagger build. And then double axe for the damage for the most part. But also utilizing Ruby Chunk for the damage. Vamp Gloves for the Nanner. I'd have to move more stuff around probably. Probably was possible. What are we going against? Blood Amulet plus a... I mean, a uh, bloody guru plus a regular guru plus a chain whip and a bunch of pets. Wow. Okay. This is going to suck, though, because of the heat generation. We're not going to be able to get there for the, the threshold that we need for the crits. Which is unfortunate. We still might win, though. Ooh. Wait, our berserker mode just procced. Oh, he's hurting us. Damn, bro. We lost three times in a row. It was a fun build, though. Man. Anytime you go against a build that creates infinite buffs with all the freaking jewels and the, those guys, the mana aura, you're just feeding them damage. And 100 critical at me at the end. Wow. That was a good game, though. Oh, these give you empowerment. Oh. Oh. Either way, good game. Good game. This is a fun build to do. Locturnal Locklifter with the uh, the Chunkies and everything. Very fun build. Very, very fun build.